and this as long as I have. Uh, I never thought I would see this moment, right? Uh, this is one of those things that I thought, I thought we would go down fighting for the cause. You know what I'm saying? Kind of romantic, you know? <laughs> like in the final breath, you know, you don't win anything, but you know, it was like, yeah, boy, he died well, right? That's sort of thing. Uh, but now I'm thinking we could really win, right? <laughs> challenges, and you've mentioned Egypt, and it's been on my mind a long time, uh, because if you look at the last time, I think a whole bunch of us from this country came together publicly around an issue. In my lifetime, it was civil rights, and that didn't happen in one or two years. We didn't go away. People didn't fight for like a year or two and didn't say, okay, we didn't really get the law passed. Or let's, let, I mean, people stayed with this thing. Year after, and it grew every single year more intense, and they would sit down and think, I wonder what they're doing next year. I mean, it was really bad. The, the, the thing that I am most afraid about, right, is that this momentum, that this is the height of it. That, that from here on in, people say, okay, Michelle's out there, go Michelle, you know. But I don't personally have to do anything more dramatic next year than I did this year. Uh, we have to understand that as a nation, we become soft around fighting for what we believe in. Let me just say a second, just to define, I was up at Wesleyan uh, at the university, a lot of black history month stuff going on, Wesleyan grads out there high. Uh, but they had a picture, they had a, a videotape of when Dr. King came to Wesley. He went to Wesley about three or four times. And I listened to Dr. King say in this like two minute thing, some of us are going to die. He said, some of us are going to die. And we got to know that's the price that we pay if we're going to change this nation. And I sat there and I got chills. And I said, look, I've been worried about the New York Times writing a negative article about me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <coughs> How soft is that? Right? <laughs> and the is talking about the ultimate price and are we prepared? So my challenge to all of us is we've got to understand that this is really like war. That, that, that whatever we've done this year is really nothing. It's about what we plan to do. And when the, the call came in, I got a call. Uh, and, and I actually liked the person. I got a call from a, a union leader who said, Jeff, now that that waiting for Superman thing is over, uh, let's talk. And, and you, I don't know if it was like the Batman movies where the, the, the Joker comes in and says, where did they get a load of me? I was thinking, where did they get a load of you all? This thing is just starting. This thing is not over. So I think we got to ratchet this up. Yeah.